Hi, I have mad meh news. Um, I'm allergic to Prozac. I know. So after like five days of being like dizzy, nauseous, fluy with constipation and diarrhea and super light, like someone took a wooden spoon and stirred my brain like thick custard. And I tried to like swing my head the other way so that it would like balance out. It did not, I just got more nauseous than do it. Um, and like barely being able to keep food down or keep food in. And I was entirely shocked with fatigue. I was just like mostly just flopping from surface to surface, trying to get my work done. Um, it was, oh my God, the physical symptoms. So I couldn't even tell you mentally whether I was just like relieved in the moments where I was not physically suffering or it worked for my brain. So I cannot tell you that now. But um, I broke out in hives. I don't know if you can see. I got mad hives. I got my hands. I've never got like crazy hand hives like this before. And it was like, pfft, pfft. and it started to itch and swell and I couldn't like bend my hands properly without it hurting. And I was like, shit. So I emailed my psych and then he told me to watch and see how it goes and the next day it was worse so I emailed him again with photos and he called me and he was like, stop. And now I'm on Zoloft, 25 mg. I'm supposed to move up to 50 mg once the 25 mg course is done. That's like a week or two, I think. Um, and we're gonna see how it goes. I mean, the nausea is still like floating in the background, but the fluy symptoms are kind of wearing, you know, they're chilling out a bit. Um, I don't even know where I am with poop, which is something that I think people need to talk about more. Like it's, I don't know if I'm constipated, but I just can't really poop. And when I poop, like it's like diarrhea, but like not a lot, but also cause I'm not eating. So like maybe, I don't know. Um, I've had potato soup, which is great. Um, I've been snacking, which is good um, to get my nutrients. I've been drinking like vegetable juice and stuff. Um, I'm still dizzy, uh, but the fatigue that hits me like a truck is still here. So most of the time I've just been like, like just trying to keep my eyes open and get my work tasks done, which has been hard but manageable, I guess. Um, and this kind of helps, I guess, when the Ritalin kicks in and peps me up a bit, but not like usual. And, you know, I'm, you know, I feel like just fighting sleep all the time is so bad. Um, yeah, so I'm, I'm hoping it works. I'm not super agitated. So that's, that's, that's a side effect I am pleased with, or a lack of side effect that I am pleased with. Um, yeah, so for sleep, I've been falling asleep about like midnight, which is wild. And I've been waking up at exactly 9 a.m. without an alarm, which is like, what is happening? I don't even know. Um, yeah, and, and that's just that I can't really eat a lot, but it's the Chinese New Year that's coming. So I have a ton of snacks and I'm very pleased. So I'm just snacking like little mouse and it's keeping me fed and I'm drinking like vegetable juice and fruit juice and all of that and coconut water and ginger tea and honey lemon for the nausea. Um, yeah, so that is my update. That is the end of my Prozac diary, which is really, really short. Um, and now we're going to start on Zoloft. Well, we're on Zoloft. It's day two now. And we're still here. Our hands haven't turn into little boxing gloves or something. It's not really growing. I hope it won't. Um, and we will see how it goes. So here is to not happiness, but regulation and stability and two-pronged treatments and not just only being on medication and also like working on my shit um, and taking you guys with me for visibility, vulnerability, education, so you don't feel less alone. You know, all of that. I think I phrased it wrong. So you don't feel alone, yes. So you feel less alone. There we go. Um, but I'll see you soon because I feel like I'm gonna fall asleep like those kids in their birthday cake like um, right now. So this is the best I can do, but I thought I'd do an update. Um, I just finished uh, the women's development chats this week over the weekend. It was very fun. There are ways to go, I'm pleased. I've also just finished a little Vice interview um, for mental health locally. And I can't wait to see how we end up with that. And yeah, so that was my fun updates for the week. And take care and see you soon and get help if you can. And if not, I hope like I managed to help you. You know, no one's alone. Mental health is expensive. It's really hard. There's stigma, all of that. I gotta go now. My battery in my brain is running out. So take care and have a great week.